All right, Brewers Corner Driver here with the last lunchtime rip of the year. So we're going to go extra big this time. I am not at my brother's cheesecake store because he's closed today. Because uh, with all the holidays and everything going on, he actually didn't have the materials to make cheesecakes today. So we the store is closed. So anyway, here we go. First, we're going to start off with some mail. Uh, I got off of eBay the Frank Robinson for my 68 set, got a really good deal on this one, and uh, yeah, no, that's one of the last major cards, I got a Pete Rose coming too, hopefully it'll be here in a few days, and then bad news on the front of my uh, 82 Brewers project, TTM, this was sent to Mark Brohard, and it came back, return to sender, unable to forward, so I've got to find a new address for Mark Brohard, or I'm going to have to go on eBay and buy an 83 Tops Donruss or Fleer autographed by Mr. Brohard. All right. Then the one that I'm really excited about, this one came from Mr. Gorman Thomas. Now, I was really excited because with all the cards I sent out, um, I sent out a copy of my card. You know, I felt like I'm asking for an autograph of them. Let me give me, give them an autograph of me. So, Gorman sent this and wrote Semper Fi on the back. Now, that just gave me chills. Now, I had just cut this open and I saw that there's even... I think he left a message. There we go. Hey, CJ. Ura. Thank you for your service. God bless. Merry Christmas. Check out my sauce. Send me an email. Nice. Nice, Gorman Thomas. So he also signed the card. That is freaking sweet. I, I got chills right now. I just can't begin to tell you. I mean, Gorman Thomas was one of my favorite players uh, growing up. One of my favorite brewers by far. Uh, you know, this would be like getting Nolan Ryan to send me a personalized message. That is, I mean, as good as. It, it's unbelievable. So, Mr. Storm and Gorman Thomas, thank you very, very much, sir. I super appreciate that. So that's kind of, then I'll sh go through the other ones I got recent, well, so far. So I've got Mr. Thomas. I've got Ed Romero. Jim and Gantner. Rob Piccolo, which I had to buy because, unfortunately, he passed away. And Harvey Keen, same deal. Had to buy that one because uh, Mr. Keen passed away a number of years ago. So, well on our way with that. Now. Oh, wait. There's another something else in there. That is awesome. That is so awesome. Thank you so much, Gorman. I, I, that is just, I can't begin to tell you. All right, so let's open some cards. We're going to start off with the Prime Packs. I think this one's got a 2020 Heritage Pack, so yay. And we got a, <laughs> that's funny. Okay, so I just mentioned Nolan Ryan, and I just got Gorman Thomas's autograph. And now we got Mr. Nolan Gorman for a card. Ironic. Don't you think? All right. So let's do the 2020. You can fast forward if you'd like, because we know this isn't the... What in the heck? Do you see this? This is a heritage pack, but look what's inside of it. And all the corners. Somebody repacked this. Literally. Cards are all damaged on the back. These are all Series 1. Now that makes me think because this one is actually cracked open. And it's got a Series 1 pack inside of it. That is really, really suspicious. I think I'm going to take this back to Walgreens. That is ridiculous. Whoa. All 
All right, Brian Dozier. 12 out of 25, Brian Dozier. I have no use for that, but I know a uh, certain uh, Twins fan that'll dig. What the heck? That is, this is not the way this should be packed, I don't think. Then we got a Minnesota Kitty Vargas and a Minnesota 69 out of 99, 199 Kirby Puckett, which all three of those will go to my buddy Fall Creek Collectibles. Check out his page. I'll leave a link down below. Oh, Rendon, Encarnacion, Eric Hosmer, Justin Verlander. But that is, oh, that is really weird. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. This says nine cards. It came with twelve cards of. Let's see if there's any evidence of tampering. I don't see any excess glue on it. That's just weird. Weird. So this really makes me suspect this because this pack is actually like, well, it's not really open. All right, this time we got a Jordan Adams Series 1. Now, let's see if this has any issues either. It doesn't seem to have. This one's actually got a security tag inside of it. All right. So, Oscar Mercado, Garrett Cooper, Brad Hand, Agrizal, soaking it all in, Juan Soto, Kevin McCarthy, Vargas, Cole, Caleb Smith, Max Scherzer, Emilio Pagan, Guerrero Jr., Nick Senzel, Jeff Peterson, and Jeff McNeil, Future Stars. So nothing really off about that. So I'm wondering, so... These are repacks, so this must have happened where they were at. Like, where they repacked these. Somebody must have switched those around, because the other package was actually sealed. Oops. Let's do the Don Ross pack. That is just really, really odd. Patrick Corbin, Paul Goldschmidt, Chase Utley, Scott Casimir, Kirby Puckett, Willie McCovey, Adam Wainwright, preferred, and a Daniel Morris, the rookies. All right. Now, last chance of 2020 to get Devin Williams. I went through all of my update, and I mean all of my update, trying to put together a set. And, uh... After I went through roughly 1,500 um, update cards, realized that I have one. One Devin Williams. I have like four or five Randy Arazarinas, which for most people that would probably be like, yeah, I got Randy Arazarina up the, up the yin-yang, but I wanted the Devin Williams, and I don't have it. So I picked these up at Walgreens today along with those Prime Packs. And let's see if I can score another David Williams. All right. MLB All-Star Rivals, Tuki Toussaint, Battery Bath, Jalen Beeks, Ryan Howard, Miguel Cabrera. <laughs> if you watched the last one, uh, you know uh, how much, or I got like four of these in one of these packs. Uh, well, four Cabreras, anyway. Derek Jeter, Not His Evil Twin, Derek Dieter. Uh, Ichiro, Mike Trout, always good to get Trout. Rice Wilson, Reyes, Descalso, uh, Cabrera, Strop. Might as well flip these around. Alcala, Peacock, Solak, Encarnacion, LeBlanc. Panic at the Disco, Ryan, 
Josh Naylor, Taylor, Taylor, not Naylor. Stevenson, Sean Poppin, Mike Fulmer. Chrome, King Griffey Jr., very nice. Cheslor Cuthbert, Rainbow. Royals, Griffey Jr. in the 85, Castellanos, Craig Biggio, Gary Carter, Suit Suit Sugio, Key Brian Hayes. Then the yellow cards, we got Adolis Garcia, Javi Baez, Julio Tehran, Todd Frazier, Joe Kelly. And, of course, Miguel Cabrera Yellow. Why not? And then another Miguel Cabrera, Judas Priest, uh, Valoria Acuna Jr., bummer, dude. Uh, Kuno, Souza Jr., Sugo, uh, Pilar, Jimenez, Keeler Maven, another Rosarina, Leon, Gruyon, Mills, Miller, Weber, Castro, Plawicki, uh, Gavin Lux, Rookie Debut, Cool Hulse, Zach Wheeler, Houston Astros, we have Liftoff, Andrew McCutcheon, Cool Hulse again, Griner, and Mew, uh, Mella, and Bato. So another Arras Arena, no Devin Williams. All right, last pack, if you would. So hopefully last pack, magic. And then stay tuned, because I got an announcement after this is done. If I can get this thing open, it's being a son of a gun. Come on. There we go. Okay, so we got a Nestor Cortez, Hatchevaria, Burlander, Todd Fraser, Flip again, Garcia, Logan Morrison, not the brewer we're looking for, Gibson, Chernos, Butera, Rockin' Philly, Ty Butchery. Billy Hamilton, oops, break it down a little bit. Poor Hulse, that guy, former brewer Travis Shaw, Steve Wilkerson, Chase Anderson, former brewer, Cal Colhoun, Taewon Walker, Joey Vato, Jason Castro, Zach Davies, former brewer, now a cub, Poor Hulse, Plutko, Heinemann, Austin Allen, getting to, oh, what's this? It's a gold, Skybolt, numbered 32 out of 2020, so a nice low number. Decades best, Dodgers, David Wright, Rendon, Grandal, Keyboom, Derek Jeter, Nick Madrigal, then the yellows, Chirinos, Tyler Wade, Philip Deal, oops, someone behind him, Justin Verlander, Felix Hernandez, Richie Martin. So no good yellows in that one. Johnson, Eric Thames, former brewer, just signed with the Yamimoro, Yamimori Giants in Japan for 2021 and uh, option for 2022. So not going to be playing in the States this year, or maybe next year, or next year or the year after that, rather. Mitch Moreland, Tellez, Tellez, was there something behind Tellez? Nope. All right, Chris Martin, Hunter Renfro, Gerald Walsh, Flores, another Cabrera, David McKay, Richard Blyer, Diego Castillo, Tomlin, Kinsler, Time to Party, Taylor Ward, 
Solano, Cano, never going to play again, Kipnis, Verlander, Harper, Jansen, Zach Green, we're running out of cards, guys, Anthony Alford, Hunter Pence, Giovanni Gallegos, and Jesus Lizard. No Devin Williams. No Devin Williams. Ah. All right. So that is the last of my pack openings for 2020. Coming up in 2021, I'm going to start a new series called uh, One for Me, One for You. Where, say, like in this case, I'll buy two updates. I'll open one for me, and then I'll open one for you. And what I mean by that is you'll go, uh, I will post something the week before the opening, and you'll have to respond in some way, shape, or form, and then I will pick a winner, and then the winner gets to pick whether or not uh, I open this for me and this for you, or if I open them both and do like a war format, and if you win, you get all the cards, and if I win, I get all the cards. And we'll, based on the product, we'll do some kind of like, in the case of like update here, we would have gone with the lowest numbered regular card um, because there aren't a whole lot of numbered cards. I mean, I got the one one numbered card out of both boxes, so that wouldn't make much sense for this product. Uh, so anyway, we'll be starting that in 2021. Watch for that. I can't wait. It's going to be a lot of, a lot of fun. Uh, I will not be doing those live, by the way. I'll run some kind of timer or something behind it so you can tell that uh, I haven't altered the um, the opening in any way, shape, or form. Uh, but basically, uh, because of my job, I don't have... It's so inconsistent with the timing. There's no way for me to uh, say for sure what I'm going to be on live. So uh, me filming afterwards is the uh, best way that I can do that or, or not filming afterward but filming and then um, then putting it up online is uh, the best way that I can do that right now so let me know what you think leave some comments down below and otherwise if you like what you saw go over here and hit that like button if you haven't already go over here and hit the uh, subscribe and hit the bell so you know when I make new videos uh, otherwise uh, you, you, go out there, have a fantastic rest of this year. We'll see you next year. Thanks for watching. Bye.